Hey, peace, family. I just want to drop a little something real quick. Hey, there's this idea that go, is going around that, you know, I think we have embraced it. And I just want to kind of just give us another look at it. Ladies, this is pretty much for you. It's for brothers, too, but this is for you, ladies. All men are not hunters, you know. So I'm going to encourage everyone to change that orientation because men don't hunt. Boys or males hunt. Men don't hunt. What draws a man to you is the calm in you, the patience in you. So a man's going to be drawn to the emotional stability you have, you know, the intelligence that you have, the essence, the very being in touch with your true essence is what's going to draw a man. When a woman is in tune with her first knowledge, which is herself, and embracing everything about herself, that is going to draw a man because that's going to be a thing that wedges or leverages your balance, which then projects a calm. Men are attracted to calm, even from the, you know, you know that's, what, that's what draws men. And that's what we're going to seek and we're going to make provisions to be around the calm. We can sense the war in you. So we're going to sit, we're going to seek to avoid the war in you, okay? It's no matter how many kind acts you do or anything like that, a man is simply going to come and respond to the calm in you. Now I'm talking about men. I'm not talking about boys. You cannot hunt calm. Calm is a virtue of empowerment. Calm is a virtue. It is a fruit of peace, okay? So you can't hunt that down. You align with it. You build rapport with it. And that's what most men are going to do when they're drawn to the calm in you. They want to build a rapport with you. They might want to seek out that calm and that rapport and have an exchange with you. So that way y'all can reciprocate something together. Something to think about. Be easy. One love.